What's up, y'all? This is Go Shoot Dude here, and this is my review on the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Dino Cycle Green Ranger. Now, the Green Ranger, well, never had a cycle in the original show, so they just had to make one up, so they gave him pretty much a duck bike. Kind of like Hugo's duck bike, almost, with this another design going on. Okay, so I can see the whole motif screen, that's a uh, little dark blue seat right here. Take him off. His posability is the same as the Red Rangers Dino Cycle figure. Same motif. It has a dragon medallion right here. You want to look at the articulation of this guy and go look at the Red Rangers one. So, yeah. So, again, look at the cycle. It's nice. It's got some white lines around it. These parts are soft. Or kind of, actually, not soft. I did that bad. Hard rubber. Uh, here's a kickstand. It does not balance on the stuff without it. Yeah, it would just pretty much fall. Okay. So, pretty interesting design. And also, these sides was all gigantic. I guess I forgot to mention that for the Red Ranger, uh, the Red Dino Cycle review. Pretend this is a normal person. Now, a cycle cannot be bigger than a person. Look at this thing. Biggest crotch rocket dirt bike ever. Okay, so anyway, just want to say something about that. And now we go to dyno mode. So this one has no complex to it. We want to take these off. Little wings, and you have to switch them around and place them downwards like this. I think every dino cycle has like a flight mode for some reason. Because the, the backwards just splits open, making like a flight mode. Okay, so that's open. And um, these can fold back. I mean, you can leave them in any way, but I like to leave them fold back just to make it look different. And you had to rip out the, dr the dragon's head. Let's look at the dragon's head. And the, um, his little horn becomes a control uh, control handle for the Green Ranger. Not bad, not bad. But it does remind me of something. I have no idea where it's from, but it does remind me of something. Hmm. Oh well. Okay. So, anyway, you got this little port right here. Plugs it onto that hole up here. And you just gotta find your way, and it snaps in. There we go. Oh, is that no? It's just toying with me. And there goes my camera. There we go. Okay, nice, good snap. As you can see, you can do it in both ways. Doesn't matter. And you fold up the wheel and sign. And now you have the cycle in dyno mode. Which is not bad, actually. It's pretty interesting. Cool. And you get the Green Ranger, just set him on here, have his hand grab onto the handles. Let's see if we can do this. Good. Because it has no elbow joint, so it kind of looks awkward for him to holding this. But you can make him hold him in this mode or in the normal cycle mode, as you saw in the beginning. So something like that. Okay, now to the fun, ridiculous part. Combining it with the Megazord. Extending my camera. So with this one, it's this arm that has to be removed. And I'm just gonna take off the Green Ranger for now. Fold these up. I'm just gonna need the fins like this. It just makes them no different. And a dragon head just like that. And combine. 
and now and now the Megazord has a dragon has a dragon arm. Big, clunky. It, it doesn't look that good at all, seriously. Like wow, dragon punch, dragon punch. Okay, so now we can get to deck mode. So. I mean, you can just put these back as normal, but I just want to even like that. Put the feet, uh, not yeah, the um, the front feet become oh, the the dragon's head becomes the front feet. Lift this up. Throw the Green Ranger in dead. This you just don't have to do, but you know I just do it for the sake of that. What that's what it says in the instructions, and it shows on the pictures. <clears throat> so get him on down. Make him ride his dragon. And then he'll be replacing the saber to tiger. I mean, this thing doesn't even stand up by itself correctly. It's wobbling. See? Okay, there we go. I actually got it standing. Yeah, we get the red rangers. Remove the saber to remove the trash avatars. Yeah, Try this is big monst monstrosity in. And you got them combined. Oh, what is that? Are you saying that he's tilted? Yes, he is tilted. The dragon's leg is shorter than the T Rex's leg. Let's see how much I can get out. This is what it looks like. I'm trying to get it on camera view. It is too damn tall. It looks ridiculous, and he's always needing to whatever side the dragon's on, because it is shorter than the T-Rex one. Why couldn't they make even feet? I have no idea. Or legs, actually. But there was also the Triceratops and the Mastodon one, but I did not get those. Because I, when I after I saw this, I was like, you know what, the hell with it, I'm going to stop right here. <laughs> so... That's my review on the Green Rangers Dino Cycle. <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more reviews from Go Shoot Dude. And I'll catch you guys next. Dragon Kick!